In this problem, we have to find the discontinuities of this function. So we have to find the x values where the function is not continuous, and then classify them as removable or non-removable. So the first thing you want to do is think about the cosecant function. It's really 1 over sine 2x. Cheap trick, cosecant is 1 over sine, because it starts with the other letter, and then secant is 1 over cosine, because it starts with the other letter. All right, so we're looking for discontinuities. Discontinuities are going to occur whenever the bottom is equal to 0. Okay, so this is where a very useful fact comes into play. So the sine of x is equal to 0. That's the same thing as saying x is equal to k pi, where k is an integer. The cosine of x is equal to 0. That's the same thing as saying that x is equal to pi over 2 plus k pi. So if you memorize these, you can do all of these problems. So in this case, cosecant's on the bottom. Now uh, cosecant, we have the cosecant function, rather. So sine's on the bottom. So that means sine 2x is equal to 0. So this is your x. So 2x is equal to k pi. To finish, you just divide by 2. So x is equal to k pi over 2, where k is an integer. k is an integer. So these are all the discontinuities, all, all, dis all the discontinuities of this function. And these are all vertical asymptotes, so they're all non-removable. Okay, non-removable. Vertical asymptotes are always uh, non-removable discontinuities. That's it.